Hello, Scorpio, and welcome to your February 2019. How do they feel about you reading? This is for Scorpio. How are they feeling about Scorpio? We are going to explore how this person is feeling and if they will take any action in regards to those feelings. This is for Scorpio. This is for Scorpio, February 2019. This is for Scorpio, Scorpio. We have let go of control issues, allow this situation to unfold naturally. So it, I feel like they're getting kind of impatient here, right? They're having a hard time going with the flow here and make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. It's almost as if they are like waiting impatiently for you to reach out to them or give them some kind of an answer or, or something along those lines. Let's see what the tarot has to say. All right. This is for Scorpio. February 2019. What is going on here? How do they feel about Scorpio? If this resonates with you, Scorpio, please like, share, and subscribe and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Scorpio out there. Keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. So however it resonates with you. This is for Scorpio. For February 2019. How do they feel about Scorpio? Yeah, they're waiting. Okay. So they, they're seeing you as a big mystery. They don't know what you're going to do here. You haven't revealed to them a decision or your feelings or, or um, some sort of secret here. This could be a um, secret relationship, hidden emotions, right? This pomegranate curtain has not fallen yet. You have not revealed to them exactly what you want to do. And they're waiting. They're waiting for you to give them an answer. They're waiting for you to put in an effort effort right they're waiting for you to take the steps towards them okay give them a decision so you see the two pillars here right so everything is a very uh, mystery to them right now you are a mystery to them they don't know what you're going to do here okay so they're trying to go by their intuition but they're just, it's a big mystery to them right now. I feel like they're getting very impatient, waiting for you to come forward. All right. Here they are waiting for their ships to come in. You are their ship, Scorpio. We have the three of wands here. This is fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They're looking out into the future. They're making these big plans and they are hoping and praying and visualizing. We'll get to that in a minute. Um, you in their future, okay? So, they are trying to work their magic. They're manifesting. They're using the law of attraction. They've got all the tools they feel to do that. They want a new beginning here with you. So, you know, they've got truthful communication. They've got uh, wands for passion. they got cup for love, pinnacle for success. And they're trying to make all of this happen. They really want this new beginning with you. And I think that you are aware of that. I think um, they have made you aware of that. And they're just waiting for an answer. Because here we have this Ace of Pentacles. So this is a gift. This is a windfall. This is a stable new beginning. A long-term new beginning here with this Ace of Pentacles. This is Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So it's like, here you go. I will do whatever it takes I'm trying to manifest with you um, this new beginning with you. I want to be stable with you. I want things to be grounded. I want our new beginning to last a lifetime. 
but they're waiting for an answer, right? Waiting for that phone to ring, waiting for it, um, waiting for you to call them and say, hey, you know what, let's go for it. They're waiting. All right, any more information? for Scorpio in regards to how this person is feeling or what actions they will take. Ooh, that wanted to pop out. Okay. Any more information for Scorpio? Any more information for Scorpio? Yeah. Okay, so they Again, King of Swords is not the most patient person, is not the most patient person here. So <clears throat> they need clarity, right? They need an answer. Let's talk about this. Let's discuss this, okay? That's how I'm perceiving this King of Swords energy. Now, this is air, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, but this can be any sign. This is the energy of this person with this impatience, right? The King of Swords can be kind of cold emotionally. Maybe they, they're feeling that from you. But all in all, I feel like this is them needing clarity. Um, because, again, they want this passionate new beginning here with this Ace of Wands. New beginnings, new beginnings, new beginnings. They're waiting on new beginnings, and they need an answer. They need clarity. They need you to take a step towards them they're very passionate about you not only passion here but um they want to stabilize the situation they want to make it long term here okay very much attracted to you though now this decision that you're having to make could be between two people and it's like the longer that they have to wait for this clarity for these answers um, it's, it's really weighing heavy on their heart here. Okay. So it's really bringing them down emotionally. They feel, it feels like their heart is breaking. The longer they're waiting, it, it's, it's becoming more and more painful. We have the three of swords here. This is more air energy, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. They want to heal the situation. They want to find balance. They're trying so hard to be patient here with this temperance card. It's a Sagittarius energy. They may, you know, want to heal the situation, reconcile with you, and they're just waiting for these answers. They're just waiting, waiting to see if you will, are going to make your decision and release them from this heartache. And so we can start this healing and we can start these new beginnings. They're simply waiting on some sort of answer, waiting for that phone to ring. So, and, and just dying to hear your voice on the other end. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Very impatient energy. And like I said, the more that they wait, it's like the, it's the harder it is and it, the more painful it is becoming to them but they they're still going to wait for you they're going to they're still waiting to hear from you and when what you've decided and what you're going to say here all right they they're waiting for you to come towards them to call them to reach out to them all right scorpio so that is what we have for your february 2019 how do they feel about you reading i go live Sunday through Thursday with the daily message around noon Eastern Standard Time. And then Friday is the live Love, Lust, or Loss, also around noon Eastern Standard Time. So check all that out. Next week, I'll already be getting out the um, mid-month check-ins for February, if you can believe it. So pretty good reading here. It's just this person... Um, is having a hard time going with the flow because it's like you can feel that tension. It's a lot of tension here, Scorpio. All right. You guys have an absolute amazing week. We will say some prayers for you. You take very good care of yourselves, okay? I'll talk to you soon.
God bless.